Welcome back. The first lawsuit has been filed against the limo company involved in that deadly crash in October that left 20 people dead in the town of Schoharie. Attorneys say the company failed two inspections and had been ordered off the road by the state in September. Justina Latimer tells us what the parents of one of the victims is alleging. This suit will not bring Amanda back, and no suit will bring any of them back. But at this point, you know, in their memories, if it can be they can prevent other situations from occurring like this, maybe change some of the laws in New York State. That, that's, that's a benefit. This morning, the lawsuit was filed on behalf of Amanda Rivenberg's parents, Thomas and Donna Rivenberg, against the owners of Prestige Limousine. The Rivenbergs are seeking monetary damages for gross negligence, pain and suffering, and wrongful death. The lawsuit alleges that the limo failed inspection prior to the crash and that the unserviceable sticker on the vehicle was removed before the incident. We spoke with the Rivenberg's attorney who said accountability is their main goal. Nothing went right here. Anything that could have gone wrong did go wrong. So there may be people who are only 5% responsible or 10% responsible. But if, if everyone who was involved had done half of their job, this, I wouldn't be here. He wouldn't be here either. So we have to prevent this from occurring ever again. Justina Latimer reporting, the law firm representing Prestige Limousine and Chauffeur Service says it's representing the company's insurance carrier and it had no comment on the pending civil lawsuit.